Good afternoon from Dollywood's Heartsong Lodge and Resort. It's Ryan. And Bree. And Micah. And Hannah. And here's what we'll be showing you on today's video. You will be able to see what it's like to check into the newest Dollywood Resort as we bring you into our room and out onto our balcony to check out the view. We'll go exploring, checking out the outdoor pool as well as their indoor pool We'll test out our climbing skills on their playground as we also check out the dining options at this resort from their dinner with some amazing food and a fun drink that every kid would love to try as well as their breakfast buffet and of course some s'mores at night. So whether you're planning a trip to stay at Dollywood's Heartsong Lodge and Resort or not, we invite you to go exploring with us to Dolly Parton's newest resort in Pigeon Forge, Tennessee. So without further ado, let, let the, the adventure, adventure begin. begin. So we've just arrived. They do have some valet parking. We're using this 15 minute parking here. And we're gonna go get checked in. They do have these little luggage carts right here that you can use yourself. Or if you need to use one of these big ones, they will help you with that. Luggage service is free. Let's go in and check out the lobby. Wow. It smells new. <laughs> you checking in? Yes, me. Oh, I'm so excited. Mm -hmm. We're actually locals and we're just staying for the night to check it out. This is a great little wall mural to take a picture. One of the first guests to stay with us. Oh. And <laughs> Require a dance? Absolutely. Come on out. Right <laughs> this here is going to be all the exterior view for our hotel for you. Everything numbered so that it's easy to locate. And then here for you is all of everything we have on our first floor. All right, now that we've checked in, we're going to go move our car to self parking. Hannah's already trying to talk us into some ice cream <laughs> and a BLT. We got to try out the new dinner place first. We're starting to get some fall colors out here. We'll have to go for a walk around the pool in a little bit so to get to self parking. We're going to go just back here to the right of the resort. Right over here is the trolley stop. So if you are going to the theme park. You can hop on the trolley right here. This is all the self parking back here. So we could walk to the right along the pool, but we're going to walk into that trolley stop area and head towards our room. We'll show you the pool in just a little bit. I believe to the right is the indoor pool. Ooh. This one is open. We'll come back and show you what that is like. Oh. You guys excited to go swimming that a little bit? Fun. But first, let's go check out our room. So we walk down this hallway. We got the fitness room. We've got some people over here that can help you get tickets oh. to the park or a dinner show. Yeah. This nice little mural. Elevator. Wow, look at this elevator. It's a Smoky Mountain elevator. Right, we are on the third floor. Ooh. We're headed to a junior suite, which sleeps up to six people. I think the kids have found our room. Welcome to Heart Song. Thank you. You guys are our first ones. <laughs> Thank you. We're excited to be here. We are the first guest. This is so exciting. <laughs> All right, let's check this room out. <laughs> Go ahead. Go ahead, Hannah. You might. Oh, oh, there it goes. Yeah. So we've made it into our junior suite. We've got these two bunk beds and I have a video with a full tour checking out what our room is like. You can watch it up in the top right of your screen or down in the description. You can watch the full tour of the room. Here's a look at the pool from our room. It's currently closed for the season. They'll open up the pool again in the spring but off in the distance is a playground. So we're gonna go check out the playground and walk around and show you all this resort has to offer here in just a moment. So we've got a little store over here, but we're gonna go get some hot wassail in the lobby. Camp DW is serving up some hot wassail. Hannah, cheers. How is it? Is it good, Micah? Uh, from the, from the book. These little lightning bugs here are one of the crafts that you can do. There's a number of free activities and some different paid activities you can do 
well here at the Hartsong Lodge and Resort. So let's check out this big fireplace here. It's not on at the moment, but let's check out the artwork. It is on. Oh, it is on. Fireplace goals. <laughs> check out this fireplace, Brie. That's amazing. You guys know who that is at the fireplace? Hannah, do you know who that is? Dolly. Dolly. Obviously, Dolly. This is a nice fireplace. How's it feel, Hannah? Nice and warm? Warm and cozy. This is a very nice lobby. From the lobby, we're gonna head out to this back area by the pool. Got lots of rocking chairs and areas to sit out here and relax. I like this little walk-up bar area over here to the left. You can go in and get some food if you're hanging out at the pool. That's nice. Mm -hmm. Big giant fireplace area over here to the right. Let's go check out the little playground area. So at seven o'clock, this is where they do s'mores every night here at the Heart Song Lodge and Resort. And up here on the left is their playground. It's not as big as the Dream More playground. We'll go check it out over here on the left. So I will say this playground is not as big as the Dream More playground, but I really love this little climbing area over here. Hello. Hello. Hello, Hannah. I can sort of hear you. I can sort of hear you. How are you? I'm good. How are you? I want to go swimming and I need food. I can't even hear you. <laughs> I can't even need <laughs> No rope needed for Hannah. So here is a look at their playground area here at the Heart Song. I do see some little musical instruments you can play. Let's go for a walk over here. I love all the trees back here. The fall colors are starting to come in here mid-October. Got some musical instruments over here. You're gonna pull them all out? You got an idea? You gonna play a song for us, Santa? Ladies and gentlemen, you're being serenaded by the great Micah. <laughs> great for kids or grandkids to come back here at the Heart Song Lodge and Resort. Or if you don't have kids with you, Bree, we got a little uh, walking path. Yeah. You go on a little, little date walk around sounds, the property here. Sounds good to me. <laughs> Let's go walk around and get a closer look at some of the pools. Got some benches to come back here and relax. Here's the view of the resort from the benches and the back little play area. So it is closed for the season, but we'll have to come back in the spring when they reopen the outdoor pool area, which would include this outdoor splash pad. Going around the pools, we're back at the parking area we were just at earlier. Here's another look at the splash pad area. And here is the outdoor hot tub. At the Dream War, they do enforce a 16 and up policy. So if you have any kids under 16 years of age, they technically can't use the hot tub, but they can use the inside area. We're gonna work our way over to dinner over here, but first let's go check out this store in the pantry and see if they have cinnamon bread at the pantry. I think they do. Here's another entrance to the indoor pool. Here is the trolley access. So we're gonna walk back over to the main lobby. And here's where a lot of the Camp DW, I think they refer to this as the back porch. We do have a little ATM down here and we're heading into Honeysuckle and Pine store to look around with you guys real quick. See what they have in here. I just wanted to give you a quick look in this video. We'll do a full tour of the resort in more detail on some other upcoming videos as I do see they have some Christmas stuff here. They do have some Heart Song Lodge and Resort specific products in here, cups, hoodies, hats, and for $20, they do have these Dollywood Heart Song Lodge and Resort ornaments. They will be decorating the resort come Christmas time, similar to what they do at Dream More. One thing you can only get in this store is this gold Dolly sweatshirt for $40. So there is a quick look at this store. They will give you a gold or diamond pass discount if you come shop in here. So from Honeysuckle and Pine, we're gonna go right across to the Songbird Market. 
You can see some songbirds up on the wall here. So let's check out real quick a couple things that they have in here. Looks very similar to the Dream More pantry. A lot of the same things that you can get at the pantry you can get here. So they have a number of coffees, teas. You can get a Frappuccino Brie. And cold brew. You're welcome to pause the video and see their breakfast sandwiches and entrees. So there's a couple sandwiches available after 11.30. They do have some light entrees available from 5 to 9 p.m. if you don't want to go where we're about to go for dinner, as well as a build your own pizza. It's like a number of grab and go items over here, some salads, some fruits, lots of chips and snacks in here. One thing I wanted to point one thing I wanted to point out is you can get Dollywood grist mill cinnamon bread here for $13. Those are some awesome looking cookies for $6. Here in the Songbird market, they do have a Coke freestyle machine. Now they don't sell mugs, but if you do have a mug from the theme park or the water park, you can come in here and use that. Now that we've checked out the store and the market, we're getting pretty hungry, so we're gonna work down here to head to the restaurant for dinner. So as we work our way over to the restaurant, if you are staying at the hotel, you can make reservations. Otherwise, you can come here and eat. You don't have to be staying here to eat at this restaurant, but it will be first come, first serve if you're not staying. Well, hello. Wow, this is, this is like grand a, welcome here. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna go sit at hello, the Ember and Elm restaurant. Hello, hello. Oh, this place looks nice. So we are going to be sitting here in the restaurant. Another option for you is you could come over here to the right to their lounge area. They have a separate menu if you come in here. Dinner at Ember and Elm was fantastic. We have another video where we look over in more detail their dinner menu along with their dessert menu in more detail as we talk to the head chef about how they accommodate people with special dietary needs. We try out a really fun cotton candy drink that kids will love along with some amazing deviled eggs, fried green tomatoes, bone-in grilled ribeye, beef short ribs that were really good, a bread pudding that's made from Dollywood's cinnamon bread, and an amazing s'mores cheesecake. I'll put a link to our more in-depth review of this restaurant in the description of this video that you can watch next. Dinner was fantastic. We're gonna go check out the fire pit. Hannah said, chef's kiss for dinner. So are you guys ready for campfire roasties tonight? Yes. So I have regular marshmallows and then I have some mixed fruit ones that are like strawberry, watermelon, lemon, orange and all that stuff. So just tell me what you want and I gotcha. Can I have lemon? Of course. I'll take strawberry please. Thank you. Watermelon. watermelon alrighty. And if you want to, I can always give you some extra one if you want to try another one as well. So they do marshmallows every night here. It's a little bit different than Dream More. Dream More does s'mores. But what you can do is come here and try some fun marshmallows and then go over to Dream More and have s'mores. Would you like some? Sure, I'll try a bite. It's watermelon. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think I've ever had a marshmallow like that. It's kind of fun to try. You gonna yeah. try yours, Micah? Micah, you got a lemon? What do you think? <laughs> we also have plain marshmallows. They do have plain, plain marshmallows, one? so you can go classic How plain or try some fun flavors. What am I trying? Strawberry. Strawberry? All right, Hannah's trying a watermelon. Watermelon. <laughs> so How is it? Probably for a regular. They just let me know they have some gourmet marshmallows incoming. So they always have classic, but might be able to try something different. But it's a nice, relaxing That's night great. here at the Heart Song mm -hmm. Lodge and like Resort. Really well done, Bree. Well done. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> it is eight o'clock local time, so they are closing down the marshmallows. But I did want to show you this little music area and playground is well lit. So you could still come out here with the kids on a nice weather day. Like this kid right here is running over to climb up the little rock climbing. So if you have given your kids some sugar, they can come over here and run it off. Sugar! <laughs> All right, I say we go check out this big fire pit over here and some of the small ones. Here's another look at the pool at night. 
You can see the chairs that you can sit on over on the left and the little waterfall area over here on the right. I did want to point out they will have a real Christmas tree, a big, large Christmas tree right here in the center in front of the pool entrance after Thanksgiving out here. And they'll have everything decorated for Christmas in November. So this is a great little area to come and sit out here at night around this big giant fire. So I know Bree and I could sit out here for quite a while in the evening, especially after that wonderful dinner at Ember and Elm around this fire, but one of the kids are itching to go to the pool. So we're gonna head back up to our room and go check out the indoor pool. You can see just lots of different fire pits around here that you can come out here and relax as a family, as a couple. I did confirm that the hot tub is open year round. So we could go out there if we wanted it until 10 p.m. We're gonna go change into our suits and head over here to the right to the indoor pool. So this is a different elevator this time. It has different artwork. Fridge works out great for leftovers. I think we have the entire pool to ourselves. Thank you, Micah. This is nice to enjoy year round. They have towels down here available for you and lots of places to sit. So let's see how the water feels. Go for it, Hannah. Oh, that was a really high throw. Got a nice covered area year round to enjoy. Oh, and get wet. I did just want to point out that it's three and a half feet here at the entrance and gets no deeper than four feet is the maximum depth. So we've enjoyed the pool. We just walked out of the trolley lobby. I love the bear artwork out here at night. We don't live far from the resort, so Bree is actually going to head back home to stay with one of our kiddos. So me and the other two will be staying here. So our junior suite might be a little bit of an overkill as far as how many people we need to sleep tonight. So we got three people in a bedroom that sleeps six. So we'll be sleeping comfortably. We just wanted to walk mama to the car and say goodnight before we head to bed here at the Heart Song. So it is now just the three of us. We're headed over to the Songbird Market. It's 10 o'clock at night. They close down at 11 and Hannah is hungry and would like a BLT that she's heard about that is served here. Along with ordering a BLT, I just told the kids that they could split one of these cookies. So now they're just trying to decide which one to get. All right, we'll decide which cookie by rock, paper, scissors. Micah is picking which one? The bear. The bear. I did save 20% off the BLT sandwich and the cookie here. If you have a diamond pass, you can get 20% off, or a gold pass will get you 15% off here at the Songbird Market. Here is a look at the BLT. It's not your classic looking BLT. It's got some bacon mixed in there. They just made this up for Hannah, and Micah is worried that he's gonna get back to the room and be hungry, so we just ordered a second one, and they'll be splitting the bear cookie. The BLT sandwiches were a hit. The kids enjoyed those. And unfortunately the bear has lost the back of his legs here. How's the cookie? It's so good. Wait, I gotta try it again. So the kids are enjoying their cookie and the bunk room here. They'll brush their teeth and go to sleep soon. So we're gonna get some rest, but we'll see you in just a moment. Once it is morning, we'll let you know how we slept. So it is the next morning. The bed was comfortable, but I will say, I think Micah really likes this bean bag. <laughs> As we're hanging out this morning, I think we're gonna head over and try out their breakfast. Oh, we got the bear. All right. Oh, it's Camp DW is out this morning. For nine to 10 o'clock, we have takeaway crafts. After craft um, takeaways, we have our Imagination Library from 10.30 to 11.30. What is that? A plethora of books out there yeah. that we can read to you, or you can actually take one and read while we're out there sitting in front of the nice fireplace. And then at 12 to one, we have family game hours. From two to three is our craft hours. And then from four to five, we have corn husk dolls. If you've ever made one of those, those are pretty fun. They're so cute. And you get to make some little outfits for them. Mm -hmm. And then we have our hot wassail from four to six. 
and then our campfire roasties from seven to eight. Yeah, we did that last night. That was fun. Yeah. The indoor pool is open. It opens up every day at 8 a.m. and closes at 10 p.m. We had a good time here last night. We just stopped by the ticket counter and got our trolley pass and time saver passes. I'll break down how that works in another video. Hannah wants to go back to the store. Good morning. Good morning. Hannah spotted this shirt yesterday, so she wants to go ahead and grab it before we get some breakfast and head over to Dollywood. So one of our breakfast options this morning could be the Songbird Market here. They do have a number of breakfast sandwiches and entrees that become available at 6.30 in the morning. We're gonna head back over to the restaurant to see what's going on for breakfast here at the Heart Song Lodge and Resort. So Bree has joined us. The gang is back together again, and we're gonna try out the breakfast here. We tried out their continental breakfast for $19, which does include a drink. They have other classic breakfast items on their menu, but like the dinner here at Ember and Elm, you can watch a separate video where we go into more detail of everything on the breakfast buffet and do our best to help answer the question of, is it worth it for you? After breakfast, the girls hopped on the trolley to go to Dollywood with friends and Mike and I headed back home. We hope you've enjoyed joining us on this opening day of Dollywood's Heart Song Lodge and Resort. This was a preview day, so there are still some final touches happening around the property, but we still had a fantastic time staying here. We have many more videos coming soon that will go into more detail about this resort and new Dollywood festivals coming soon. If you found this video helpful, do us a huge favor, hit that thumbs up button down below and make sure you are subscribed. If you're not, we would love to keep you updated on all things Dollywood in the future. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you on the next adventure.